must be Raven. Interesting. You ready to climb the wall? Okay, here we go. Space. Activate the AC. The final frontier. <laughs> Laser. Welcome, welcome! This is Armored Core 6, Fires of Rubicon, and I am Mighty Z, for those of you tuning in for the first time. And this is our next playthrough, and we are going to have a great time. This is our first From Software game on the channel, so that means a dreary, bleak world and really hard bosses, <laughs> but a lot of fun along the way. This is the first Armored Core game on the PC, and the first one I have owned. So bear with me. Okay, let's do this. I know these games have super duper high speed robot action and I love giant robots. So let's see, okay, we got jump. Got a little boost here. Okay, we can move around. Wow, it's way more fluid than I thought it was going to be. Okay, got missiles, shoulder weapons. Wait, and a sword. Wow, this really feels like Virtua Odd. Haven't done a Sega Saturn series yet. We're gonna get to that, but uh, that's good for me. All right, that feels good. Nice. I didn't expect to be this mobile. Okay. Okay, I got a little jump jets. All right, this is my, I've never actually beaten a From Software game. I've never owned an AC. So, uh, this will be the journey of a beginner and amateur learning to be better, and I intend to learn and get good, as they say, so bear with me. If you're an expert, you will be rolling your eyes as I make incredibly obvious mistakes, probably even within now, <laughs> honestly, but um, I'm learning from scratch, okay? Don't got anyone to teach me, and uh, we're going to do it how we do it. You know, um, I, I like uh, shoot 'em up games and fighting games and stuff, and I've been playing those for years, and I'm imagining if I had to watch somebody learn one of those from scratch, it would be a travesty, but uh, we're gonna do what we do. Alright, got the lock-on action. Okay, we have some enemies here. I'm sure they're just... Really slow and die really easily. <laughs> Just to make us feel good to start. Ooh. Got a big thrust. Alright. So, uh, this looks like a dodging game. Some games are dodging games, some games are blocking games. This seems like they want us to dodge uh, the bullets and stuff, which is fine. Alright. Wow, we're really mobile. I was really expecting to be like a big, clunky, like mech warrior mech. Cool, 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 cool. All right. 
yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, last week we had Sega Genesis Master System games on the channel, and this week we're playing the new hotness. Mighty Z is chaos. <laughs> Embrace it. You never know what's going to happen. Um, life happened. I do not get paid for doing YouTube in any way, shape, or form, so I had to go focus on my work and other things to replenish the funds and everything. So uh, there weren't a whole bunch of different things on the channel, but we did have a little birthday showcase recently. So thank you for the few of you who tuned into that. That meant a whole lot. Didn't think anyone would actually watch those, but it's a passion project. <laughs> Played Battletoads, uh, Sonic, and Rocket Knight Adventures. Another game where I talk about loving robots. And, um, yeah. Also, those of you who tuned in for the Clone Drone and the Danger Zone playthrough, uh, this is a little different, isn't it? Alright. Got a scan. That's pretty good. Wonder what the scan scans for. Ooh. Ah, there we go. Desolate, bleak, from soft environments. <laughs> As expected. I, um, I owned Sekiro, never beat it. Got like halfway through and it was dreary and it was hard. <laughs> um, barely touched souls. Um, didn't play Elden Ring. I know it was fantastic. I know it's legendary. I might get to it eventually, but too busy. Massive open world games can only handle so many at the same time. <laughs> All right. Ooh, gonna launch ourselves here. Is this part of the world or mechs that common? Hmm. Right here we go. Coral. Is that... Well, I'm sure it'll make sense. Probably an energy source. It's always an energy source that people fight for. Ooh. Are we not good guys? <laughs> Sneaking in and finding ID seems like some Black Ops stuff. Alright. I know nothing of the story of Armored Core. Other than people waste billions and billions of dollars making giant robots, which will be destroyed in a few seconds instead of using the money to solve their problems <laughs> peacefully. There we go. Smack. Feels good. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, so we use our salt thrust boost to fly distances, okay. Definitely have a stamina though. Or energy? What, the, what are they gonna call it? Okay, here we go. Well, that girl sounds really young to be in the military. <laughs> she sounds like 20. Okay, so there's some freeways for scale. Yes, we are indeed a giant robot. Look at that. Look how big we are, the interstate. Nice. That means this city is actually really ridiculously huge when you think about it. Look at all this destruction. Was this all like mech battles or war? Hmm. Once again, I know this is six entry <laughs> in a series, but the last entry was like 10 years ago on a system I don't think I had. <laughs> The Sega Boy and the Nintendo Boy. I don't think we had Armored Core. I don't know. Okay, let's see. And obviously, there's the first PC entry, as we said earlier. Okay. There we go. Again, a feel for it. This feels good. What the? Okay. Whoa. Whoa! Okay, we are a giant mech. That means that helicopter is ridiculously huge. <laughs> and I'm sure we'll never see it again. 
<laughs> Corp license easily traced. Forget it. All right, so we don't want to be traced. We're doing some shady stuff, trying to figure out. I don't know if. Uh, you guys watching know who the protagonist is or if it's supposed to be mysterious or if it's a Continuous every game or if every game is a different story in the same universe. We'll find out. I'll research it later I'm Try and analyze this and move on Okay no. Go away! Oh, that's not working. Missile's doing damage. Go away! Okay, that's how far the sword lunges. Need to know that distance. That's gonna matter. Alright, there we go. Alright. Oh, swords make short work of shields. Like uh, Walter said. Good to know. I do know a few things like I know you can run out of ammo so I'm not sure if I want to engage with every little skirmish that comes up per se but I do probably need to learn before something big and bad comes to fight and it's from soft so something big and bad will come to fight or something small and incredibly fast and agile in this game I guess I don't know what bosses are like are usually other mechs I assume or craziness, so... Going in fresh. Yeah, we're an independent. They make us sound cool, but that means we don't have affiliations. <laughs> wow, I just... I look how big the fire escapes are compared to this mech. This thing is huge. Something this big being this mobile is terrifying, actually. Okay, gotta get used to this. Okay, the auto lock, pretty good. Just switches between the targets, pretty pretty accurate. That's gonna be good. I guess they give us the auto lock because they want us to focus on movement, which goes with the dodgy dodgy kind of mindset this game probably has. I'm not speaking as an authority, I am trying to figure it out as we go. <laughs> Let's see. And uh, if you have any kind-hearted advice, feel free to leave that in the comments. But do bear in mind, by the time this, this airs, I will be further along in the game, and I may have corrected the mistakes. This is day one for me, so be kind. <laughs> All right, got another ID. So we're trying to go in high rank. Mm. Go and check it out. No, that's very video gamey. Uh, all three are guaranteed fails. Why don't you go check out this last one in this weird abandoned area here? Is it going to be a large, flat, open abandoned area, perhaps? <laughs> Classic. Okay. Okay, I got to get used to the boost stamina. Ooh. All right, so we got some j upward catapults. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, don't have to fight once again, especially if we're going into this ominous larger separate area. Save that ammo. How does it work? I did not read that. I was thinking about being witty. <laughs> uh, the button you press? Oh, you just jump. Okay, <laughs> that's easy enough. Do that really quickly. All right. Cool. Try accessing the rest. Yeah, look at this perfectly square shaped open area. All right. I'm gonna scan this ID unsuspectingly. I don't want any trouble. I'm just trying to steal an ID so I can illegally immigrate to this planet and do shady things. Just leave me alone. I don't want any trouble. Uh oh. So you no yeah you're coming for me. <laughs> it's a trap. <laughs> Go away. All right, our first armored core boss battle. Let's do this. 
Okay, what do you got? You're not a mech, but you're really huge. Oh, you got rockets! Okay, you got weapons. Okay, that's what your advantage is. You got way more rockets than I do. Okay, let's go. Right, gotta get used to the sword and launch distance. Leave me alone! Wow, you got a lot of bullets and rockets! Lots of rockets and missiles! Uh-oh. Okay, you are very well armed! Oh, that's bad! Okay, so we gotta dodge these. Oh, crap. Oh, and I take it you're not gonna run out of ammo. Let's heal a little bit. Ow! Oh, no. Oh, yeah, the dude who made Sekiro made this. I see now, yeah, you have the exact stagger bar from that, and so do I. <laughs> okay. Good to know. Okay, so I'm not going to do any real damage until you're staggered. I don't know what staggers in this. Not like I'm parrying with a katana or anything. Uh, probably... I'm going to guess the bullets? Or maybe just damage in general. I don't know. Or maybe shooting you in a specific spot staggers you. All right. I will figure this out. <laughs> just keep, just bear with me. All right. My first mech day. Let's do this. Shoot me some missiles. I can use some cover. Yeah. As long as I use this, as long as I use the cover, I could hide from these missiles. But he's moving around so much, it's kind of annoying. Use the cover. Oh, his missiles curl! <laughs> they thought of that. Stay. Ow. Ow! Crap. AP. I don't know what that is. I'm gonna assume that's health. <laughs> oh, God. Attempt one. <laughs> Try this again. Okay, maybe we should get a good position this time. Let's back it up. Let's back it up. All right, Mr. Helicopter. Fool me once, shame on me. I can fly, though, for a limited period of time. Okay, let's use that. Okay, how do you dodge those? Okay. Let's go. Okay, I know this is bad. Hopefully, I can come back and do this later and practice a little bit between sessions. Let's go. Ow. Come on. Okay, I gotta jump to avoid the explosions, but we... We can fly, but we jump slowly compared to missiles. Okay. Gotta dodge those. Okay, dodge a couple. Come on. Come on! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Let's go. Come here, you. Yeah. Come on. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Stamina broken. I mean, stagger. Whatever. Whatever it's called. Okay. Gotta do some damage. Gotta do some damage. What does more damage? Uh, probably the sword, I guess? That would make sense. I don't know! <laughs> I don't know! <laughs> oh, crap. Well, you can see the missiles load before they fire. That's good. So I, I guess that gives me a little warning to jump. Gotta learn the bosses in FromSoft games. Pay attention to the movements. I'm gonna shoot you. I'm gonna shoot you. We're doing it. We're doing some damage. We're doing some damage. We're getting there. We're getting there. Ow. Now, these missiles are perfectly... Ah! Designed to curl around cover. Attempt two. <laughs> okay. Okay. Okay, let's do this. Okay. It's hard to stay in the air. He keeps flying out of bounds. I can't follow him. Okay, there you go. I think they want me to go in and get close. That was the Sekiro thing. It's like, no, don't. Don't hide and peck at him. Like, go in. 
That's what they want. That's more actiony. Be an anime robot. <laughs> okay, let's go. Let's do this. Ow! Okay. That missile went into my head. Ow! Okay. Not doing too much damage. We're hanging in there, though. Alright. Staying close. He can't hit me with the missiles if I'm, like, under him. No repair kits remaining. Okay, out of repair kits. Thank you, computer. I don't know if my AI buddy has a name or if you're just a computer. Ow. Contact damage. Stay in bounds, you jerk. It's not fair. <laughs> I can't fly out there for some reason. All right, let's do this. Come on, you. I'm not giving up. Ow. All right. I'm not doing well with that stab at all. <laughs> Probably doing some generic HP damage, though. And in, when his HP goes down, the stat girl go up more quickly. If it's the same general concept, I do not know. I don't know if this is new or if this is how AC always was. Yeah, Smack you! Oh, that did some stamina. Okay. Stagger you some more. Oh, damn it. Alright. We're learning. We're learning. <laughs> just gotta stay close. Stay close. Stay close. Smack you. I will smack you with my sword of justice. Bring the sword of guardian angel Gabriel's blade upon you. Well, I don't know where good guys actually. I, I might be, uh, these helicopters might be just like the authorities patrolling, doing their job, but I'm just some crazy criminal. <laughs> yes. Smack you. Come on, helicopter. Your soft underbelly is your weakness, and I will exploit it. Let's go. Walt's talking like it's already done. Get this stupid wall. He can hover outside of the stage. It's so late. <laughs> Nobody said it was going to be fair. Especially not this company. Okay. I know this boss is super easy, probably. It's my first time, okay? Bear with me. Okay, let's go. Okay. Uh huh. Huh? Okay. You are trying to trick me into slamming into this invisible wall so you can riddle me with bullets and missiles. I will not fall for it. Uh, again. <laughs> You're stupid. The missiles curling out into the side is actually really annoying. It, I mean, it's wise for them because, you know, it avoids cover, but annoying for me. Come on. Come back into the stage, helicopter jerk. Let's go. All right. Hell yeah. All right, we did it. Look at that. Confirmed. Heavy combat helicopter is down. All right. Boss one. Here's the call sign from that license you picked up. All right, we are Raven. Raven. That's, new name here on Rubicon. That's not emo at all. <laughs> I'm Raven. Yeah. <laughs> cool. 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 All right. Well, this is uh, Armored Core Six. 
something new. A sublime substance. Ah, here we go. Discovered on Rubicon, a planet on the frontier of mm -hmm. space. For a time, coral was a revolutionary energy resource and data conduit. Of course. Poised to transform human society by leaps and bounds. They called it the fires of Ibis. A storm of hmm. flame that tore through the stars. Oh, crap. Lethal contamination in its wake. Coral, the kindling, was thought to have been utterly consumed, forever lost. Huh. All right. However, on Rubicon, the embers continued to burn. Ah. Uh, okay. Would inevitably return. Well, we'll find out more about that next time on Armored Core 6. Registration number RB23. Call sign Raven. Authentication complete. Removing MIA status.